Hey homies, welcome back to the channel. How you guys doing? What's going on? Uh, yeah, today we are filming from my carport. Mum's working from home inside and I didn't want to make too much noise and the weather's good so I thought I'd sit somewhere shady and quiet and somewhere with decent lighting. <laughs> so hopefully we don't have too many contrast issues but we'll see how we go. Um, I've already done my base. We are going to recreate this eye look right here from an 80s themed 21st I went to a few weeks ago. Had an absolute blast. Um, yeah, that's, that's really all I got to say. Um, I am wearing cotton on gym clothes. I went for a walk earlier this morning. Who am I being productive and all that? What's going on? I don't know. But I, I'm not hating it. So the palette we're going to use today is 39L Hit The Lights palette from Morphe. I still love this with all my heart. <laughs> it's one of my favourite palettes ever. Um, I have primed my eyelids because I want to be able to take this pink stuff off in the next couple of hours. <laughs> Uh, just gonna go in with a fluffy brush and the shade no regrets and from that party I have no regrets um, do do love me a bit of a boogie and meeting new people sort of thing so there's that you know how it goes we're just gonna stamp that onto the outer edge and buff our way inwards through the crease I can't remember, honestly, exactly how I did this, but I do have a vague idea. And the wind is sort of there today, so hopefully that doesn't interfere with our audio too much. But, game, see how we go. So, gently just buffing that in. Should have set the eyeshadow primer first, but that's fine. I find that if I go in like circular sort of motions as I go, it buffs the colour out without having to go back in and blend it out properly. Well enough for my liking anyway, everyone's a little different, hey? Sitting out here makes me realise how goddamn hungry I am. I do want to bring that out just a little bit. Just a little bit. It's 80s. Everything's blown out. Dramatic. Alright, I am relatively happy with that. What we're going to do next is take a sort of flat packing brush and the shade Reckless, I believe. It's the bright pink. And we're going to pack that onto the lid. It's a very, very pink look. And as we know from my last video, I am not a big pers big fan of the colour pink, but how good does it look with my blue eyes? If I do say so myself. It's a little arrogant of me, but I don't know. The colour pink suits me, I just don't like it very much. It's just like it's a little too much for me. Just a little bit. Alright, I'm just going to blend that together a little better with a bit more of the shade No Regrets. Not too worried about that little patchy bit in the corner because we're going to go over that with some eyeliner. Now I've ruined this. Alright, and then what I'm going to do is take a little bit of the shade Euphoric, which is a sparkly pink. And we're just going to bring that shade to life a little bit. okay if it's messy it doesn't have to be crisp it's fine um then what we're gonna do is if i can find one all right so i don't have a little fluffy brush out here with me so i'm just gonna take a little lip brush and we're gonna take a bit of the shade don't stop which is the blue look at it there's bugs and we're just gonna pop that on not in your eyelashes on the lower lash line I picked up way too much. I've ruined this. Okay. 
Okay, yeah. Some a little like that. That's not as neat as when I did it the first time, but it's fine. Um, then what we're going to want to do is pull out our water activated eyeliner palette. Um, yes, this does glow in the dark, I promise. Um, not in the dark, in um, UV lights, I believe. Yeah, UV lights of some sort, but it looked bomb at the party. It looked so good. Um, do have with me a glass of water so that we can wet our brush. And I am gonna try doing this with an angled brush so that I can get that nice crisp point. Um, but I do have little detailed brushes with me as well. So we can chop and change as we need. Okay, so this is what we're looking like. Um, I'm gonna quickly do the other eye and pop some mascara on. With this look, I opted for no lashes just because my friend had a pool and I knew we'd end up in there at some point in the night and I didn't want the lashes to be bothering me. I don't wanna have to take them off and like leave them somewhere that I shouldn't have. Um, this yellow, you do have to build up quite a bit. So I ended up just sort of like stamping it on with the angled brush. And then I went in with the fine detail brush and like just did the inner corner. Um, you could do is put some bright hot pink liner on the lower lash line just to sort of emphasize the pink of it all. Um, I can't bother today, but that is an option. Uh, yeah, I'll be right back with ya. Bam, there we have it. Um, obviously we have to highlight, duh. Uh, the usual NYX Strober Genius. I feel like that's just a given at this point. Like I'm too scared to use any other highlighters. Like I know that I like this one. I know this one. Um, I'm just gonna go in with one of my fingers into this sort of pink shade here. I'm gonna use that for the inner corner. I cannot see what I'm doing properly in that. <gasps> Not too much. I actually don't think we'll do the brow bone today. I don't know, I'm just, I don't feel like it's going to make a difference to this. This is already enough on its own sort of thing. Um, and then with a brush, I'm going to dip into the usual two shades. We just, we know how that works at this point. Not too much, not too little. Good dusting there and there too. Um, and then instead of using lipstick, because I knew I would be drinking and that lipstick would not last for that, I went in with a little bit of coloured lip balm. So we've got Rose Addict, which is a shade from the Baby Lips Maybelline collection. And bam, that is my makeup look for the 80s theme 21st I went to. Um, yeah, I was really vibing this, and then I'll insert a... <laughs> Here is a video of me doing a snorkel, because it is the only thing I have with my full outfit in it, and I was absolutely vibing. Absolutely loved it. So, yeah. Have a great week, and I will catch you guys in the next one.